everybody. Welcome back. These are some people that got caught lying on the internet. It's suspended. Did you have a good I, license on that day that you drove the car? I did not. Why was it suspended? I have um, unpaid parking tickets, and I failed to appear court. On whose car? I'm sorry? On which car did you have unpaid parking tickets? Um, um, before I was um, be able to drive. What? Yeah, I had a license before when I was driving. I asked you, on what car did you have parking tickets? On uh, my mom's car. That's a lie. They wouldn't suspend your license if you had parking tickets on your mother's car. Yeah, because I failed to appear court. What difference does it make? They were parking tickets. It goes to the car, <laughs> not to the driver. Well, that's... Yeah. She was too busy thinking of her next lie that she forgot to answer the question. That's how you know someone is lying when they don't answer the question. Also, who lies to Judge Judy? Like, she, she's gonna know. She's Judge Judy. From one judge to another. <laughs> Catching a cheater on TikTok Live. And you for sure don't have a girlfriend. You're not trolling me right now. No, I'm not trolling. Because I don't do cheating. No, I'm a complete bum. I haven't had a girlfriend in a minute. You want to know something funny? What? I know you have a girlfriend. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I'm friends with her. Yeah? Yeah, and you're actually a really big scumbag for this, so. Oh. Do you have anything to say about that? No. Because she can hear our conversation right now. And so can uh, TikTok <laughs> Live. So, you got, yeah, that's what I thought. He hung oh, up. Oh, wow. Nice, well done. Look at his girlfriend's face. Look at this. <laughs> That is the face of someone who has been bamboozled. Bibbidi bobbidi bamboozled. What a dumb thing to do, honestly. You're on TikTok Live. Everybody records those things. Why are you lying on camera? I don't get it. Infested in lies. What? Are those. Is that lice? That doesn't look like lice. Bro, are those chia seeds? Hang on a second, hang on. You know, the only person infested in lies is the person who posted this video. That is not lice. I know a chia seed when I see one. <laughs> I ate some this morning in my pudding, my healthy pudding. Infested in lies, yes. <laughs> It's not even lice, it's everything bagel seasoning or poppy seeds. No, babe, it's chia seeds. I bet you anything, it's chia seeds. <laughs> chia seeds? It's just crabs. <laughs> they just dumped Montreal seasoning on his head. <laughs> you had me go in there for a second. That was a close one. Oh, guys, I caught a liar the other day. Do you wanna see? All right, so as you guys know, I flew out a fan from Australia to come and see the swipe life. So this premiere, was a private screening. All right, I knew every single person on that guest list. I know every single person they brought. There were less than 100 people there and I knew every single person personally. So someone wrote this on the video where I'm talking about having flown out a fan from Australia. Like literally, I don't know, I was really proud to have done that. It made me really happy to meet one of you guys. So I was reading through the comments, just like, oh, everybody's so nice, oh my gosh. And then I see this one and I'm like, the gift was nice. I did not attend the after party, but the movie was meh at best. I still love you. Mm, I'm sorry. Sorry, who are you? <laughs> you never saw the pilot, so I'm not sure why you wrote this. How do you know that? My attendance is personal information and I do not like it being shared. Okay, so if you attended a private screening for friends and family and the cast and crew, how did the pilot end? Oh, I'm sorry, no response, no response? Let me just say, guys, all right? You're entitled to your opinion, you're entitled to hate it, but at least, like, watch it first. <laughs> Don't lie about having seen it. Like, that's so weird. So absolutely not. Believe me, I am expecting some people to not like it. Like, I am, but the fact of the matter is nobody's seen it yet. And the people who have seen it, gave it a standing ovation, that's all I'll say. I will toot my own horn. It took me probably five years and 11 panic attacks to get to this point, so I'm very proud of it. 
Like, damn. Hi, this is DoorDash connecting you to your Dasher for updates about your order. My goal today is complete customer satisfaction and a five-star rating. Please rate me as your five-star driver. Your order is on its way. Have a great day. Very disappointed. Why is that, may I ask? Pizza left on port, received no indication it had arrived, no knock on the door or doorbell ring. Pizza now cold and needed to be heated in the oven. I rang the bell, sorry. Here is a video of you not ringing the bell. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. So, like one star or what? I love how we're already preemptively asking for the five stars. You get a thumbs down. I'm not sure who this woman is, but she did not allow me into an event in Chicago to see Monarchy last summer. Now this year, she kicked me out of a show in Milwaukee while Justin Martin was playing, and now I'm banned from ever stepping foot into the Miramar to dance again. Just thought I would share this information with all underground peps. You were caught smoking quack, quack. in the bathroom. <laughs> you are no longer welcome at our events. Quack. Around and find out. And how tall are you? Six foot. Six foot? Yeah. Can I measure you and check? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Uh oh, is you really six foot? I <laughs> don't know. Hold on. Woo, let's see. Am I six foot? So I want to get five ten. Oh, dang, five ten, eh? Oh, so you lie about your. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, there's a big difference between 5'10 and 6 foot. Let me just tell you. There is. Height changes during the day, bro. <laughs> What's the difference between 5'10 and 6? Sounds like someone who's lied about his height before. You're rounding up, I see. Bro's 5'9 without shoes. True. True, true, true. Due to inflation, my guy's six feet. <laughs> Guy gets caught lying while trying to impress a TV crew. I don't know who this is. Can I pick this up real quick? Okay, hold on. <laughs> This is KB, can I help you? Listen, when you say A-list, we're talking like Brad Pitt, we're talking... This is unbelievable. Hold on one second. This, this was not scripted. <laughs> can you tell me exactly who it is? All right, let me... Let me call you when I'm done with breakfast and I'm away from uh, these people that I'm with. And the call I'm, drop. What was your name? <laughs> that is so embarrassing. Can you just give me a first name? I gotta call you something when I call you back. <laughs> Jane? <laughs> okay. All right. Uh, probably about an hour. Thank you very much. Bye-bye. This, I swear to God, that was not set up. Oh, you, you swear to God, eh, God? Well, your swears don't mean much, do they? You're gonna take that up with the big man. How absolutely embarrassing. Lying to the TV crew and they caught it on camera. <laughs> Next time, put it on the other cheek, you know, so they can't see the call drop. I wonder who he was actually talking to. WTF, I'm at the hotel by myself. Sends a photo, cause that's not suspicious. Look, here is proof. I'm going to sleep. I had a dinner with my dad at a Brazilian steakhouse. Text me back sometime. Love you. Good night. Hang on a second. What is wrong with this photograph? Let's zoom in, shall we? Let's look at the mirror. What is that? You see that? That, my friends, is a purse. That's a purse. Unless man's is starting to wear some murses. Some ladies' murses. He ain't in there by himself.
You're already, look, you're already turning red, Corbin. Oh no. That is the guiltiest face I ever did see. You can't eat eggs, you're allergic. Other dude, you have to peel it first. I, I was listening to that and I'm like, why are you even teaching him how to eat an egg if he can't eat it? Do you watch porn? No. Why are you lying? You liar! You're disgusting! It's not my fault. When do you do it? I don't in the do bath. It. I know it's when you have Ew, a bath. In the bath. <laughs> You're revolting. It's not my fault. It, I, I, like, Did you watch? Right, next question. <laughs> you watching bum sniffer? Did you? Did anyone see like absolutely zero difference between this guy and then the little kid that we just watched? The egg, the egg kid, the lie, and then it's not my fault. It was an accident. I accidentally fell into the bath and pulled up the the spicy website by accident. Also, why lie about something like that? Come on, be realistic. Nobody cares. Cheater complains that his girlfriend is falsely accusing him of cheating, gets exposed by his own comment history. Girlfriend thinks I'm cheating on her because I want to spend Christmas Eve with my dad who lives alone instead of her. I've made it clear to her that I would spend the whole day of Christmas day with her, but it's no use. She cried and told me to pick up the gifts I had given her. Because you did cheat on her. When answering an Ask Reddit question, why did you cheat on your partner? Your answer was two reasons. <laughs> She's always so negative. She gained a lot of weight from being slim fit to triple chin obese. She is like the girl I fell in love with morphed into another human being. 23 days ago, eat crap. God, if it isn't the consequences of our actions. You know, the funny thing about Reddit is like pretty much everything that you ever post, unless you switch accounts, like there's a history of that. So just be careful what you put on the internet for likes. I'm watching you, Wazowski, always watching. You got an iPhone? <laughs> is it a four digit code, six digit code? Four. Four, okay, interesting. Just lie to me now. I'm gonna ask you for a passcode. You're just gonna lie. Liliana, what's your passcode? Just lie to me. Uh, four, seven, three, two. One, two, four, seven. <laughs> hang on, hang on. How did he do that? Okay, that's spooky. How the hell did you do that? I feel like this is fake. Like, there's no way. Come on. I refuse to believe it. Absolutely not. So you didn't ask daddy for candy? Yeah, I didn't ask him. He just gave it to me. He just gave you candy? Yeah. But you came and asked me for candy, and I said no candy. Yes. So did you go ask daddy for candy? No. Then how did you get candy? Because I put it on the counter and then he opened it, then he tasted a bite and then he gave it to me. You win this round. Do not do that again. <laughs> oh gosh. That little grin when she knows she got away with it. She gets a pass because she's cute. The rest in this video, 